I am blessing, a health worker with Amot. Since 2010, Amot has been working to save the lives of mothers, children and babies in rural area of Ebony State, Nigeria. Our slogan is, Every Life Counts. Since the Every Life Counts program started in 2018, in addition to support surgeries in the tertiary hospitals, we have started to make pediatric surgery accessible in the rural health centers. This year, 2023, we have over 40 pediatric surgery done in this health center. So the common surgeries we do, we come to do here, are surgeries that can be done as day cases, elective surgeries that can be done. That means you come and do the surgery and the child recovers, starts eating and is discharged home the same day. We have operating theaters in several of the primary health care centers where we can do minor surgeries like hyenography, hydroselectomy, appendicectomy, right there in the village health facility. Our dedicated staff always go the extra mile for our patients as we work to provide every support needed to ensure that no one dies due to lack of financial means. Since the beginning, Amot has provided support for children's emergencies. This includes surgical interventions. Uh, this is my son. I observed some swell up of his abdomen. And that's what brought me here. He's about to go into surgery. I pray that Almighty God will lead him and let him come. Jesus name. Amot has been able to make surgery accessible to the villagers. We know that um, children don't make decisions. Okay, so when they have a surgical condition, they need an adult that will make decisions to bring them to hospital. And maybe most times because the place is very far from town, so most adults may just um, not regard the symptoms of the child. But because we come to the rural areas to do the surgeries for the children, I think with this that Amot is bridging that gap of distance. Major cases like intestinal obstruction, intussusception, uh, typhoid perforation, uh, uh, shunt for uh, hydrocephalus. When these cases are identified, we refer to our referral center. It's one of the patients that is being referred from uh, one of the facilities from Amot. This patient is having what we call a typhoid perforation. We are preparing him for theater. Looking at the, most of the centers, the nature of the road where they are taking, bringing patients from to these our facilities, I said they need, really need or deserve an award. One of the things that I have seen they do, once they send the case, they will follow it up. People are trying. Sometimes I will look at the amount of where your healers will consume, but because of one patient, you will still deem it necessary just to save life. This is my genome brother. In fact, they, they, they take care of him. They, all the payment, everything they did. In fact, I am really saying, may the Lord be with them. This is my wife and the baby that I was talking about before now has gone through the operation and the operation was very successful. I want to thank uh, the doctors and the nurses that have made the operations very successfully. And I also thank the AMOT who have helped in supporting us financially. And I want to use this opportunity to thank the AMOT people because they have been helping, especially the less privileged. They are the ones sponsoring everything, all the drugs, investigation, blood, making sure that the blood is available. They are here assisting in every angle. What you people have started, may you continue with that. At the end, the Almighty God will bless all your efforts. Thank you, Amos. We are happy. I'm very, very happy. In 2023, Amot has assisted over 218 pediatric surgeries for children and babies, as you saw in these videos, with a life-saving surgical interventions and care, 
please donate to sustain our level of assistance in 2024. Every donation will be doubled through a matching fund from our main sponsor. Remember, every life counts.